Welcome back, everybody. I hope you enjoyed that segment on hypnotherapy. I absolutely love Mr. Dennis Parker and everything he's doing up there. Are you going to come take a class with me? No, but oh. here's... Alrighty. Here is what I wouldn't do. What? If you go to, and they've had these guys out there for years, okay. who you will go to a comedy club, and yes. they'll invite oh. people up on stage to be hypnotized. Mm, that's not and what he does. No, it no, 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 no. It started there, actually. It's really interesting but Dennis because is that's, a, is that's a, a part of that whole thing. But he's a great guy. But I would not want to ever be on stage in front of a whole crowd and maybe my significant other and be hypnotized. So he'll tell you about that because basically that is, it's all about like your brain and levels of consciousness, which is all hypnotherapy is and you go through all the levels that they take you through going to sleep and waking up every day so you are basically hypnotized you go through all of those to go to sleep and to wake up and what he says is those people that are doing the comedy stuff basically you go in and you're just relaxed enough that you're sort of willing to go into that state where you don't care and so it's kind of like uh, you're in the driver's seat at the end of the day, all those people up there. So it would be one of those if you were, say, in a relationship you didn't like, you might want to steer clear of it because you might tank it. That would be a bad thing. But that would be a bad thing. It is funny to watch those people, but I would never get up on stage. And it's invariably the guy, and it's always a guy, who says, you can't hypnotize me. And then Every time. Every time they go, yeah. you know, it's kind of one I of those. I think we need to go and, go and do that, you and I, because I really want to see it. No, I no, want to no. see you do something crazy. There is, yeah, there's no percentage in that. But having met Dennis, and, and he's such a good guy, and, and again, the human mind, we're, we're programmed to remember our failures. Yep. We don't remember our successes. That's just how the human mind is programmed. And if you can overcome that, it, people, and he everyone's... And you how to do it yourself. Everyone's yeah. capable of great victories. And if you don't let your natural, in a golf cart, Mm -hmm. They call it a governor that prevents it from going too fast. Uh -huh. We all have governors, and if you let your, if you turn your governor off, you're capable of great things, yeah. and that's what Dennis teaches. And yep. you know, we were talking earlier about, you know, a, a positive media reinforcements, be it podcasts, be it apps. Mm -hmm. If you include a little bit of that in your everyday, yeah, just it's that amazing. positive. You can achieve a lot, and no one wants to be around negative people. So if you have that cloud over your head or you're dealing, we all have people that are like that or super negative, and no one wants to be around. So if you can start your day with a little positive energy, Agreed. and it doesn't necessarily come internally, sometimes it, it can come through prayer or meditation or sometimes listening. Sometimes you have to, to make it happen. You have to make the positivity. But the place where Dennis is amazing and where... I would say you can have all of those things around you and still be making decisions that are tanking your life. If that subconscious is like ruling the road and you are going down to a place you don't want to be, and you don't know why, because it's that underneath thought that is like making stuff happen. And he goes in, he teaches you how to get to those thoughts, get rid of them, and then you get to like have a successful life. Then it's easy to wake up and listen to something successful and like go and do it. You know, exactly. if you have all those, all it's like he calls it weeding the garden. And great speakers are so much fun to listen to. And I used to I listen to them in my car. I was a great speaker just now. I feel like I was struggling so but hard. Motivational speakers, people that just make you feel good about life. Boy, listen to those guys, get a chance, and they make your day so Download much better. Download the Prosperity Club app. It's amazing. It's a great resource. And, and I, I think it's super awesome. Okay, Mr. Trip Mitchell, thank you so much for joining us today. It was a wonderful day, and um, I think we need to go eat cake. Cake is always good. That's, what, love. that's what you do. I'm Trip Mitchell saying thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time right here on Talk 365.